Good day, one what fly squad. Welcome back to another Thursday trip report. I'm at Brisbane Domestic Airport and today I'm going to fly Jetstar A320 from Brisbane to Adelaide. Now let's go and check in. I'm at the Jetstar check-in counters and today Brisbane Airport is very quiet. It's not even five yet and there are only two remaining Jetstar flights departing for Adelaide and Cairns. Borders restrictions are still in place across Australia. That's why many flights have been cancelled. In fact, today the 31st of August from 9am, travellers from Queensland won't have to do a COVID test or quarantine when they arrive in South Australia. So I legit just dodged the bullet. In fact, not bullet, but a cotton swab. Well, as a result of the recent lockdowns and borders restrictions and flight cancellations, not all the shops in the airport terminal are open. Luckily though, the Qantas Club and the Qantas Business Lounge are open. And today, with my gold status with Qantas, I can use the Qantas Club Lounge here at Brisbane Airport before my flight with Jetstar. Qantas owns Jetstar, that's why when you fly Jetstar with a Qantas status, you can use the lounge. Jetstar, however, is not part of the One World Alliance, so say if you're an American Executive Platinum member, you can't use the lounge before you fly with Jetstar. So I just got myself a chai latte from the bar. From the buffet, I got a bowl of bacon and corn soup and a plate of vegetarian pasta and now I'm just doing my usual butter in the soup thing so I got some time left in the lounge so I just relaxed a bit and went for a second round the flight later is gonna be about three hours and there's not gonna be a lot of food so I'm gonna fill up my tummy here Hello, I'm in the Qantas Club Brisbane shower room and it's pretty cool here. The space isn't big but it's practical and it's quite pretty. So when I left the lounge on the way I went to the bar again and got an English tea. So when they made the tea for me, they did almost everything right, but it was just the timing. They added the milk right after the boiling water, so it was so milky. Here's our aircraft to Adelaide today. It's a 15-year-old Jetstar Airbus A320-200 Victor Hotel, Victor Cabet Hotel. This aircraft has actually just arrived from Adelaide as JQ783, so it's now going to turn around as JQ782 to Adelaide. Boarding started technically on time, however, the queue wasn't moving at all, and then later the staff through the announcement said that it was the day one of a new system rollout, and then something went wrong so they had to reboot the system, and the reboot took about 10 minutes. Hi. Good. Thank you. Thank you. Good, thank you. Thank you. It's going to be up in that, um, right on the yeah. window. Thank you. <laughs> Welcome on board, Jetstar A320. My seat today is 21F. The seat configuration here is standard 3-3. Every seat is about 18 inches wide. Seat pitch or leg room, about 29 inches. I'll now quickly go through the seat features. So there's no personal TV, but you have a literature pocket up there. You've got a funny looking coat hook. And then the tray table, you can pull it down and then move it back and forth, but you can't fold it. This side of the table is curved, so if you've got a big belly like me, you'll be alright. You've got seat pocket with nothing in there, so you can put your personal items in there. And the fact that it's empty, you have a bit more knee room. Oh no, oh, oh, oh. Baby crying and I can't see anything. Along with Kathy, the cabin manager, and the rest of my lovely crew, it is my pleasure to welcome you on board this service from Brisbane. Stepping down to Adelaide this evening. Thank you all very much for your pump boarding. It certainly has held down. The ground crew are working hard right now just to load up on all the cargo as well as all the passenger bags. I do see the cargo door is open. I recognise we a couple of minutes ago we were supposed to be getting ready to push back and go. We'll give these boys a little more grace, another five or eight minutes or so, I'll suggest they'll have that door closed up. Claire and I'll get some paperwork and we'll be getting ready to close up and get going. 
Hello, we're doing the flying birds, and I don't have a chat to you, give you some more details during the journey. But for now, well, Kathy and the rest of the crew will go Thanks very much, folks. Boarding's completed, cabin crew now doing a hair count. Two hours and 25 minutes, subversion of welcome our corners and our co share customers. Yes, our credit card holders in corners for your flyers travelling with us today. Cargo load is currently being loaded onto the rear of the aircraft right now. From what I understand, there was a reconciliation error between what they, the information they'd been given initially. Looks like they're just starting to resolve that right now, having all the cargo loaded correctly on board. I'm guessing around about another five to ten minutes from now. I'll keep you updated if it does change, but I thank you very much for your patience. Make sure you're familiar with the breast position best suited to your seat. The odd That's what mums do when they don't trust your piloting. There's a menu on board, you can use your credit card or debit card to pay. When I purchased my ticket, I opted for the Starter Plus bundle, which includes 20 kg of checked in baggage allowance, seat selection, Kwanzaa's points and status, and also $15 voucher to use on the menu. 2 Soon after we took off from Brisbane, the cabin crew began the meal service. From my observation, a lot of passengers purchased alcohol and also toasties. With my $15 credit, I used it all on this tasting plate. So the plate includes red wine, white wine or sparkling wine, cheese and crackers, and then either olives or salami sticks. So I went for the salami sticks and also they ran out of cheese and crackers so I got Pringles instead. Hello there, welcome to Jetstar A320 Economy Class Lavatory at the back, I mean they've really got off economy anyway. Uh, this is at the back of the plane. It's quite tiny but it actually looks pretty good. We've got coat hook. And then you got the bins there, the flush button, and the floor looks pretty cool. Our flight today is pretty full with most middle seats occupied, but I got really lucky somehow, I got a whole roll for myself. So did a passenger behind me. So I got a little bit red and blushed from that red wine, so I'm going to relax a bit and have a short nap. Please give them to a member of our cabin crew for disposal or you can dispose of these items in one of the quarantine bins in the terminal. Please be aware restrictions are currently in place on moving some fruit and vegetables within SA due to fruit flight outbreak. Find out what you need to do by visiting fruitfly.sa.gov.au. 
I'm really, really grateful about the fact that South Australia is having a fruit fly outbreak rather than a COVID outbreak. To give you an idea of what the fruit fly outbreak is like, I live in the outbreak zone. So basically any fruits that's gone into my house, including bananas that I bought from supermarkets, I'm not allowed to bring it out. Any fruits that's been to my home, I have to eat it at home or put it in a compost bin in my home. We're about to descend into Adelaide Airport, so I'll quickly conclude this trip report with Jetstar right here, right now. So my journey today started at the Jetstar check-in. It was really fast and easy there. I used one of the self-check-in kiosks and then I couldn't check in because I was a bit too early. And then I approached the staff, she manually checked me in and did everything for me, like backdrop and everything. And I really appreciate that she did it for me because I always can't do my back tag correctly. Security at Brisbane Airport was also fast, there was like no lines. And then the Qantas lounge was lovely, the shower room was beautiful and the soup and the pasta were delicious. At the boarding gate, before the boarding commenced, a Jetstar employee approached a lot of passengers to weigh their bags. Thankfully my backpack was way under that 7kg limit. Funny enough, a passenger actually managed to go through security with like a checked in baggage size bag. Like it was so big there's no way she could bring it on the plane and then obviously she had to pay and check that in at the boarding gate. There was delay at the gate and also at the tarmac but I really appreciate the fact that the Jetstar employees including the captain kept us really informed throughout the delay and today I had a really comfortable flight with Jetstar mainly due to the fact that I got a whole roll for myself and I could lie down and sleep a bit. The tasting plate was $15. I wouldn't say it's great in value but it's quite good that it was included in my ticket. The Jetstar cabin crew today were really nice. I had a really warm welcome from the cabin crew at the cabin door and very good service overall. The cabin crew would come around the cabin like every 15 to 20 minutes to collect rubbish and they were very polite throughout the flight unlike many of my previous Jetstar flights. So that will be it for my conclusion today and for your information. Today I paid $101 for this one-way flight from Brisbane to Adelaide which includes the bundle. The bundle itself costs about $30. So thanks so much for watching and now here we are One World Fly Squad. When you start flying again please don't forget to tag me with a special hashtag on Instagram so I see where your journey is taking you. If you're new to my channel, I'm glad you made it to this video. I upload a new trip report every Thursday 12pm Hong Kong time. That's 1.30 in the afternoon in Adelaide every Thursday or 2 o'clock in Queensland. So you definitely don't want to miss out. Quickly click that subscribe and bell buttons so then every Thursday you'll get notified. I would also appreciate if you could like this video, comment down below and share this video with your friends. Each and every of your action will help the growth of my channel. You can also keep up to date with me on my other social media platforms including Instagram, Snapchat and Facebook. I also offer memberships on Patreon and YouTube directly. So that's all I have to say today. Unfortunately there won't be a vlog or Q&A at the end of the video today but I promise there'll be one next week. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next week. Goodbye.
technical time is 9.32. Chefs, I would like to acknowledge the traditional custodians of this land. We would also like to pay our respects to elders past, present and emerging. Today we exit through the forward left hand door. Please take care when opening their red lockers, just in case any luggage has moved throughout the flight. If your phone is within arm three, you can now switch it on or out of flight mode. Smoking is strictly prohibited as you disembark the aircraft and three out airport terminal buildings. Thank you. Welcome to Boston. For your safety, please remain seated with your seatbelt fastened and your cabin baggage stowed until the seatbelt sign has been turned off.